The Frames toolset allows you to create structural members or segments that create structures or weldments. The Frames toolset is located in a Part Studio within the Feature Toolbar. Frames are modeled within the familiar Part Studio tab and can take advantage of top-down design techniques by modeling multiple parts in a single Part Studio. To start a frame, create a sketch, curves, or even select existing geometry to define the segment lengths. Then use that sketch or geometry to make selections to define the segments using the frame feature. Select a profile and the segments. OnShape provides a library of standard profiles, but it's also very easy to create custom profiles and make them available for all company users. More is covered on this later in this course. Each segment selected in the same frame feature must have the same profile throughout the entire length. Use multiple frame features to create segments with different profiles. The powerful Frame Trim feature trims the segments around each other or around other parts within the Part Studio. You can mirror and pattern the frame segments and even model additional geometry like cuts or holes as needed within segments. Once the structure is created, calculate a cut list by using the Cut List feature. This groups all identical segments together to count a quantity needed for each unique segment and calculates properties like length and angle. The Cut List feature creates an open composite part with the selected frames. This function enables you to either use the entire structure as a single part in an assembly or drawing, or each unique segment as an individual part to easily detail in a drawing. All of the options in the frame features are completely configurable, which makes it easy to model variations of a structure. This course explores creating structures using the frames toolset, defining a cut list, inserting the frame in an assembly and drawing, and creating custom profiles.